When we take care of breast cancer patients, we often have two options for them. And one is called a lumpectomy, also known as a partial mastectomy. The other option is a mastectomy, meaning the whole breast. Our biggest goal in doing a lumpectomy is to get clear margins. So when we talk about margins, this is what we mean. If this is the breast tissue, and this is the tissue I take out, the margin is the surface of the tissue I take out because it's the margin between what I took and what I left. And if the margin is positive, you have to worry that there are cancer cells left behind in the same area. When we're doing a lumpectomy, we want to get rid of the cancer and some normal surrounding tissue so that we're sure we got all the cancer out. And the margin probe is a device that we can use in the operating room to actually look at the edges while we're in surgery to see if there's a problem. If there is a problem on the edge, in other words, if there's cancer on the edge, we can fix it right there and then because the patient is still in the room and still asleep, and that reduces our chances of having to go back to the operating room for a second surgery. Margin probe adds very little time to the operation, maybe five minutes at the most. Prior to the advent of margin probe, I was really flying very blind, not having any idea whether or not I had removed enough tissue. Because the margin probe is used directly on the lumpectomy specimen and does not touch the patient, there are no side effects associated with its use. Because all patients who are having partial mastectomies have either invasive cancer or DCIS, in my opinion, they're all candidates to use the margin probe because all of those people want to have negative margins. So why wouldn't you use all the tools that you have at your disposal to increase your chances of success the first time around? As a surgeon, part of my weekly set of tasks is to look at last week's pathology reports uh, when they come due. And the first thing I think when I start to read that report is, how are my margins? How are my margins? Because that's really gonna tell me whether I need to bring this patient back to the operating room or not. And when I see that I have a positive margin, despite everything that I've done in the operating room to try to prevent that, my heart just sinks. And I can't even imagine how the patient feels if I feel as bad as I do as the surgeon, imagine how much worse it feels to be the patient who gets that phone call. And in my practice, Margin Probe has reduced the number of people I have to call by half. When I use Margin Probe, it gives me the confidence of knowing that I'm doing everything I possibly can in the OR to get clear margins and get the best possible patient outcomes.